This is Spanish for Beauty and Aesthetics, vocab 151 through 155. Significar means to mean or to signify. For example, if you introduce someone as your significant other, it means the two of you are in a serious, committed relationship. Or if you say, what does that signify, it means what does it mean, okay? Now I want you to notice it starts with the word sign, like a, a stop sign. And I think when they put up a sign, it should be clear what the sign means. Example, there's a sign in my neighborhood with a teeter-totter, and it has one cat in each side of it. And the first time I saw that, I had no idea what that sign could mean. I thought, is there a teeter-totter in the middle of the road? I mean, is that what that means? Or, or are kids going to be launched into the road from a teeter-totter? The other sign that just cracks me up, it says, slow children. <laughs> How would you like to have that sign in front of your house? I mean, what does that mean? Your kids are developing, developmentally delayed? Now I know that that sign means you should drive slowly. There are children around, but don't let them put a sign in front of your house that says slow children. Now, nobody's going to miss candidate, candidato. It's the same word, just it's got to know at the end of it. Now, nominee, like he was a nominee for uh, an Emmy or a Pulitzer, is nominado. Um, what do I need to do or what does a person need to do to become a nominee for the Academy Awards? Or what does an actor need to do to become a nominee for a Tony or an Emmy? To subtitle, you know, like if there's a Spanish movie with English written below it or an English movie with Spanish written below it, it's subtitular. And you are able to read the subtitles. See the U? You are able to read the subtitles. A lot of the same letters. This is a pretty easy list. Remember, the green letters mean the letters are the same, even the same order in both languages. Now, if subtitular is to subtitle, subtitulos is subtitles. You, see the you, can read the subtitles. Get it? You can read the los subtitles. One of the easiest lists we've learned. Um, just remember, significar is to mean, and don't let them put weird signs in front of your house, <laughs> like slow children. <laughs> Sorry. All right, let me cover up the Spanish. Take a moment, look at these English words and say the Spanish equivalents out loud, or even better, look at these English words and phrases and write the Spanish equivalents down to make sure you can spell them. This has been Spanish for Beauty and Aesthetics, vocab 151 through 155.